Hello, my name is David David Okonkwo and thank you for joining us today. Today the church, or specifically the Catholic Church, celebrates memorial of the Blessed Virgin Mary. We remember who Virgin Mary was and still is in the life of the church and those who believe in Jesus Christ, specifically the Catholics. And in general, here is a woman, God himself, who is the creator of God of mankind and the world found worthy to honor her and elevated her above every human being. First, by making her a spouse. And so, conceiving God on earth, she became a window through which God came into the world in human form. So that through human form, Jesus so redeemed the world. She became the second Eve that stayed faithful to the course. A woman, a mother who raised up a son. A mother who made decisions both right and wrong, just like any human being in our world today. What an example for all today. She lived at the time when men dominated the world. She raised her son who is the redeemer of the world. She raised him even to his ministry. Just as we say, mothers know best. She knew when Jesus was ready. Even when he, Jesus, did not know he was ready. She called him into his ministry by drawing him to his first miracle in Cana, as we see in the Gospel of John. The mother who knew pain, be it the pain of labor of bearing Jesus the baby or the pain of Calvary. A mother who first loved her son and gave him her best. Her best love, her best caring, her teaching, leading or in all manners mothers do to their children. She is a mother for us all as a mother. She stood there with her son, including at his critical moment. From the time he, from the time she knew of his arrest by the Roman soldiers to the time he died on the cross, she walked with him and bore a cross no one else could help her bear, even more scarred pain than the labor pain. The inability to help her son on his way to Calvary, carrying the cross and the beatings, so she makes a perfect model for us. Call her to aid you and you will not be disappointed. Let us pray. Remember, O oh, most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection, implored your help, or sought your intercession was left unaided. Inspire with this confidence. We fly unto you, O Virgin of Virgins, my mother. To you we come. Before you we stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in your mercy hear and answer us. Take our prayer to God the Father and plea on our behalf, on behalf of women on migration journey, that those in prison and to end women abuses in homes, in workplaces, in all over the world, especially in our churches. Hear and answer our prayer. Amen.